Hi, it's Michelle from Movement Lesson, and I was just going to take a quick moment just to describe my table. The table was built for me by my husband. When I had it built, it goes directly to my knee height. So in other words, people get this all the time in my class if I'm, if I'm barefoot or without shoes. Really hard for me to give a lesson. I've so organized myself with shoes on with this table. Um, so some of the things you'll look for in what I do is again, it's not that I'm just working on somebody. I have to be organized. I have to do these movements just as well as I'm doing them or recreating them in somebody else. And again, it's not an I thing, but a, 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 almost like a dance. So when I'm here, I need to be supported for me as, as much as possible. So this is my table, literally. And um, you'll see the same too if I come over here and, and just grab the chair. So again, it's the same thing where my knee lines up. Now I can adjust my chair. I love this little dinky thing from Ikea. Um, but it, I'm always looking to support myself. I have a conversation going on here that's the same level as my table. Um, so you'll see things like this or like that. Um, if I had to do it all again, over again, I probably maybe would have knocked the corners off just to allow myself a tad more access, but say la vie on that. You know, there's a lot that I can do here with my knee off to the side. Um, but that's just the workings of my table and, and how I work. You know, I'm supported here. It's through my foot all the way up to the shoulder. See it better on this side. And uh, so I'm my, it allows my fine motor skills just to be there. If I was like this with tight abs trying to work, you know, and again, you'll start seeing I don't have the fine motor skills like I would if I'm like here. And so I'm, I'm on my system and that's, that's how I work. And that's just me and my table. So, thanks.